Hey YouTube, this is Monica and I'm coming at you with a quick little video. Um, this is just randomness stuff. Anywho, just pretty much, um, updating you guys on, um, my past video, my excuse for being MIA. But yeah, I just wanted to talk to you guys and let you know that yes, 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 I was super duper busy. As you know, um, the end of school was here. I had, um... One of my sons go from the fifth grade to sixth grade. He graduated. Um, he had a graduation ceremony, um, so he'll be going to middle school. I had one with strep throat. I had one with pneumonia. I was babysitting, yes. And my brother and sister-in-law went to Jamaica. And this was my little souvenir they brought me back was my Jamaica mug so like I said to you guys busy 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 I, I also wanted to come back with another little quick thing um, thank you to everyone who has commented on the video about the things that I got from my husband for Mother's Day you will not be disappointed you really would not with the pure body oil so go check it out one that I forgot to mention in that video <laughs> that he got me was this one called pink sugar pink sugar by Aqualina this one here is it's I'm not gonna tell y'all that this one is a um, run out and get it does smell good but this one is an acquired you have to like you have to really like um yeah so maybe that's why I forgot it in the first video because it's not one of my my tops but like I said it kind of grows on you it really does this one I think he was maybe reaching a little bit sorry hubby love you but um yeah I'm not too sure if I like this one I'll come back later after I start um, using it as you can see it's all the way to the top I've never used it um, I'll come back with a review on this one after I use it for the first time another quick little update is the Island Kiss by Ascada Okay, yeah, why is this one almost about to take the place of the uh, Daisy by Marc Jacobs? This one is a absolute must-have. Island Kiss by Scotta. Gotta run out and get it. Um, yeah, so on to the, um, what was going on with um, my organization that I'm involved in. Um, the Friday night we had a Bachelorette Expo and that is... Um, that was sponsored by Pink City Entertainment, which is a sister company of Project Curvafield. That was a fashion show also, which included models from size 2 to 16. And it was a fun-filled night. Um, it had, um, like I said, fashion shows. It also included the male review. Um, just fun 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 that was such a busy weekend because the Friday night was that the Saturday was the curve appeal uh, fashion and beauty expo that's where um, we had fashion shows I actually um, walked the runway in the pit in the picture that you saw on the video and my second outfit was a swimsuit yes <laughs> a swimsuit it was a one-piece swimsuit by Monique C banging um, ruffles on this shoulder and uh, an optional strapless or strap on this shoulder I personally don't have any pictures on my camera of it but if I get some from my sister then I'll post a couple of those um and then like I said that second day um aside from the beauty and fashion expo we had a model me experience which is basically an opportunity that's open to the public like a um, it's pretty much like a glamour shot. So you can register to come to the Model Me Experience um, hosted by or presented by Project Curve Appeal. And you come there and you get um, you get um, a photo shoot. You get your makeup professionally done. You get classes which include photo editing, runway training, makeup 101, um, model etiquette, and also um, um, 
a class which teaches you on undergarments because the one thing that we try to get you know full figure women to understand is that while um, that foundation which is your undergarment is very important we're not trying to mask our size or change our size just make yourself look neat and presentable so that's why some type of foundation is very very important so after that day that started at about nine o'clock in the morning um it didn't end till well after midnight because the event went on till five o'clock in the evening then you had a after we had an after party after that so busy 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 by Sunday I could not even walk another event that I forgot to mention was the um international um atlanta international pageant now that was my first time ever going to something like that but it was a drag queen pageant and um what happened was we were we were double booked in the same venue we went to practice one night and we couldn't really have access to the entire building because they had booked this event also so as a way to compensate us for um you know not being able to practice they allowed us to um attend the event free so it was awesome let me tell you it was amazing now you definitely have to have an open mind you can't live in a box or think that you're better than a person because of the lifestyle that they choose in order to enjoy an event like this and thank god that i'm open to accepting people for who they are because this was an amazing event i am so glad that i had the opportunity to attend to look at these men transform themselves into beautiful women and this pageant was serious you hear me it wasn't no play they wasn't making a mockery out of um, things they had like there was also women there in drag not necessarily men in drag but women in drag also and there was a regular size and a plus size competition so it was awesome 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 the entertainment was amazing so that that is one experience that I am so glad that I had the opportunity to um, take part in and since I've been in Atlanta I always wanted to go to something like that and it just worked out perfect that I was able to attend for free so uh, yeah I'm pretty sure y'all are so 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 tired of hearing me ramble on but I did want to come in and talk to you guys and let y'all know I missed y'all so so much I appreciate y'all for hanging in there with me thank you to all of my new subbies I mean I was gone for three weeks and you guys kept sub subscribing to me and I appreciate that so much thanks to all my old and new subbies and I'm just glad to be back loves you guys loves 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 and remember like I always say if they can't handle you at your worst they don't deserve you at your best smooches